In Terraria, there are four main classes, Melee, Ranged, Magic, and Summoner. They make up four distinct playstyles, and each of them have their own upsides and downsides. However, a small group of weapons and items don't fall into any class. Instead, they don't have any listed class, and thus fall into a class of weapons known as Classless Weapons. Due to this, these items don't receive any class damage boosts like every other weapon, and even damage boosts that supposedly affect all damage types, like the Wrath Potion or Avenger Emblem, don't have an effect either. Since damage boosts are very important to the combat aggression of Terraria, classless weapons are rather rare and generally serve an auxiliary purpose in combat of any kind. Of all items able to deal classless damage, only three are held weapons that directly deal classless damage. You can tell when the item's tooltip simply says X damage, instead of referencing a class. Of these, the first one is the Flare Gun, a utility weapon that is also able to light enemies on fire. The gun itself has a damage value of 2, which cannot be modified. However, the flares it fires actually deal range damage, so it is possible for the Flare Gun to deal more than 3 damage, if you had an insane range damage boost of 100% or higher. This one is probably the most used classless weapon, simply for its burning ability. The second classless weapon are the Throne Waters, which are extremely obscure items on their own. They are mostly known for their ability to contaminate nearby blocks when thrown, but the projectile itself is able to deal a solid 20 classless damage. Not really anything special. Lastly, there's the Lawnmower. While this weapon doesn't have a listed damage value like the other two, if you're moving, you can deal a fixed 8 damage to enemies caught in your path. This damage is even more unique though, as it's not affected by Terraria's damage randomization, instead always being fixed at 8. I guess it's not really a traditional weapon, but hey, it deals damage so it counts. And also it sucks. Aside from those three though, there are a few more items that inflict classless damage. For example, mounts. Now you might be saying, Terra, the mounts do summon damage. And you're right, most mounts deal summon damage, but there are two exceptions to this rule. These are the Scutlix and Toy Take mounts, which fire bullets or lasers at enemies as a sentry. They deal around 100 to 150 damage per shot though, so it's not like they're underpowered without damage buffs. Minecarts, when used to smash enemies or flash enemies, will also deal classless damage. However, minecarts actually take their critical chance from your highest class, so it's not completely unaffected. Accessories that deal passive damage, like the Bone Glove, Bone Helm, Starcloak, and B accessories, also deal 25, 18, 75 to 225, and 13 to 16 classless damage, respectively. The unique Thorns ability of the Cactus Armor, which doesn't really reflect damage as much as simply dealing it, is also classless by nature. It deals 15, 30, or 45 damage, which, like the Lawnmower, is also not affected by damage randomization. Quite odd as well. Likewise, Orcalcum and Chlorify armors, which attack enemies actively, are also classless and don't benefit from any damage boosts. However, not all armor damage is classless though. For example, Spectre armor inflicts 100% of your magic damage as an orb attack, making it not a true classless attack. In all, all these are basically support and utility items and such that don't really fit into any class, and thus just haven't been given one. That's it. Unlike the classless weapons in Calamity, they're really nothing special. Just support and utility, really. I wonder if it'd really be possible to do a whole run with only classless damage as your main attack. I imagine that you'd start from the flare gun and fight the moon lord with a mount or something. Sounds painful, but then again, when has that really stopped anyone? Hello, if you're part of the three-fourths of my audience who aren't subscribed, I ask you to subscribe. Here's a video about some wings you might be interested in. Either way, thank you for watching, and good day and goodbye.